I was thinking about the day we met When the love came rushing out And you were empty-handed, filled with regret I was thinking about the day we met When the love came rushing out And you were empty-handed, filled with regret Saturday morning, about 6.30 a.m. We just woke up to the sound of dogs sniffing around our campsite. Alex is up making breakfast, and Corey is doing a photo shoot in the back of his car. Got a little bit of a late start to what we were wanting to do. That's okay, because Alex is cooking bacon right now. Good morning, Corey. Yo, how'd you sleep? Mm, seven out of 10. Seven. That's a lie, six out of 10. In the middle of peaceful outdoor sleep, I was awoken to this snarling slash breathing right next to my tent and I just had a flashback to Jurassic Park and thought a T-Rex was coming into my tent except it's just some random person's massive husky oh what base camp is packed up we're gonna go try to hike grandfather mountain the mountain that we went to yesterday that was closed when we got there and then go check out some other stuff does anyone know why they call it grandfather mountain nah maybe it's just old on the road again just got out of the car real quick because clouds over the mountains <laughs> hey how are you the student id work I got a CD where the bump this in. <laughs> Well, Corey and I were trying to do an Instagram mission where I ran across where you're not supposed to hike all the way to the edge and some worker came and yelled at us. Shut that down. He tried to arrest us, but we outran him. He's about 100 yards back. Yeah. We totally flamed him. Alex, Alex videoed the whole thing, but for legal purposes, I'm gonna delete the part where we evaded. Ooh, ooh. Yeah, he said it was like a true suspicion. <laughs> Corey? Do you think it was worth the $20? Mm, not, on a, not on a Saturday, too many people. Yeah, there was a lot of people who couldn't really take the pictures that we were wanting, but it was still really pretty. I think 20 is a little much, but that's just I would've paid. I would've paid 10 I'd happily. I'd like 10. This is what Instagram missioning looks like normally. You are just uh, walking on the side of the road. Walking on the side of the road. That's the road we're taking a picture of. Okay, the Lynn Cove Viaduct. I'll give a eight and a half out of ten. Definitely cooler than Grandfather's um, Rock, Grandfather's Mountain, Grandfather Mountain. Okay, we're done shooting for now. Gonna go get some lunch. Woo! Downtown Boone right now. Well, the sandwich was a uh, three out of ten, <laughs> but we're gonna get dessert now because that's always lit. Thank you. Back in the car. Okay, last stop of the day. We did a spontaneous detour. We are at Roan Mountain in North Carolina. I was here with Craig a couple weeks ago, and. It was snowing and it was in a cloud and so we couldn't see anything. People are looking at me weird because I'm talking to the camera, but I don't. Corey and Alex have never been here, so we, we're just like, we have to do it. We're driving past it. It's only like 10 miles away. Beautiful. It's very windy though, so you might not be able to hear me, but it'll be fine. Lots of B-roll. because
guys. It's pretty up here, but the main view is like way, super, super far away. Been up since 6 a.m. going from spot to spot. We're still a good four hours from my house. It's been a great day, except for that sandwich that we had. It's like a three out of 10 sandwich. And Alex just said it was like hospital cafeteria level sandwich, which I think is very accurate. Except the hospital cafeterias would probably heat the cheese on the sandwich for you. This place didn't heat the cheese. Empty handed filled with a recluse. But I'm still like, hallelujah. hallelujah.